guys, Tara Lee here, and uh, I hope you guys like my new do. Yes. Is it just me, or is, isn't a weight loss journey supposed to have steps on what you did to lose the weight? It's just before and after pics here, babe. Right? You have to think differently. this last week because I was trying my best to get down to the 120s this week and it's like not happening for some reason I'm stuck this is why I tell people when you're in the beginning of your weight loss journey like, all you really have to do is like change into the right habits once you get the right habits the weight will fall now since I'm towards the end of my weight loss journey um, I still have the habits but I think my body got so used to uh, certain routines so you have to really confuse your body or it's not going to you know do what you want it to do I do have winner for increment one right here Cody I'm about to mail off your shake and um, right now we're in weight loss challenge number three increment number two so everyone who put in their their pictures for May 8th is still in the running I hope you guys saw that video if you haven't already make sure you check it out I want to talk to you about my adjustment and my evaluations for this week now it's June 19th and I found myself stuck at 135 I did my hair one reason just to kind of change up my mood and sometimes you just have to do that sometimes you just have to pamper yourself or do something out of the ordinary kind of just to give you incentive to just continue on because this journey of weight loss is rough you know so but you still have to think positive. I praise God for getting me down to the 130s. If it's his will to get me to the 125s, he will make the way. Some people will look at me like, oh, Charlie, what are you talking about? You're so small. What do you mean? But you know, your weight loss destination is up to you. No matter what anyone else says, it's up to you. For me right now, I want to get to 125. I'm at my weight, but I'm not at my goal destination yet, okay? Now, what I've evaluated this week is uh, I found myself getting caught up again in work and I'm not exercising as much and just following a food schedule is not working for me anymore. Like, I feel like I'm maintaining the weight. So now I got maintenance down pat. Right? Um, it's more of like I still want to lose. So I'm going to do more cardio. For example, when I go to mail this off, I'm going to walk to the post office instead of driving. You know, walk a little bit more. Um, God has been so good to me. Uh, my home based business is doing magnificent. So I'm able to really help my girls actually in daycare part time now. So I'm able to do a little bit more. Um, this way I have more mommy time, which we all need sometimes, right? Uh, with AJ gone and all that. Anyway, look at me telling you my problems right um, I'm gonna do a little bit more walking and running um, tomorrow probably I'll go around the track a couple of times you guys will be be there with me for that as well and uh, yeah that's my evaluation it's more of okay in the beginning of my weight loss journey I could just eat right and I'll lose the weight but now that's not working so I'm gonna change up what I eat as well still be on the Yoli um, but I would eat, change the meals up. I'm eating the same foods over and over and my body has just, I think, got tired of it. Uh, I'm going to really up my cardio and maybe like run around the track, you know, all cardio just to shred fat. Yeah. Up. And we'll see what happens next week. Again, like you guys know, this is a trial and error. This is a journey for me, just as it is for you. And I'm hoping from my trial and error, uh, you, you'll learn from my experience and not do the same mistakes. So once you get to my state, you know what to do. You know, well, that's all I have for you today. Till next time, God bless. And I wish you well.